Thankfully, the failures of the last year are now behind me and I'm looking forward to the usual high survival rates for all of my eucalyptus and polonia and other seedlings that I experienced during the first three years when I set up this business. There have been positives during the past year, notably putting this grow room together with a heated base, which has just been fabulous. The heated base, quite a lot of varieties, polonia in particular, require high temperatures to propagate, so 20 degrees C and above. But not just that, it's a controlled environment, so the temperatures don't soar up above 30 degrees and quite a lot of varieties, especially some of the eucalyptus varieties, don't do well in high temperatures. So as I say, some really good positives. Now that I've worked through the issues, I've been busy germinating, sowing seed and plugging up the seed which has germinated. I think it will be around 12 weeks before I start to get decent quantities of plantable eucalyptus available. Perhaps sooner for the polonia which really respond well to warmer temperatures and longer daylight hours. Possibly around six to eight weeks. In the meantime I do have some stock of eucalyptus, primarily archiri as you can see there and a few more this side, and pulverulenta. These would be a smaller variety, an ornamental variety, fabulous for flowers. And as you can see, these are very, very healthy. So as I say, it's not all bad. I do have limited stock of some eucalyptus varieties. A few more varieties here, Cochifera, snow gum, in reasonable condition. Some gunnii, I think they probably require another two or three weeks to become a bit larger and fill out their root plugs. More archiri and a few viminalis. Quite a few blue spruce and Scots pine in good condition. So do have a few varieties. So get in touch if you're interested in these and I'll just give you a look at the polonia that I also have in stock. Another positive would be going through that learning curve in terms of germination and propagation last year was probably the ideal time to do so. It was very dry last year, we were on water restrictions, I would have struggled to keep a large stock of plants hydrated. Also, at the end of last year, there was the severe cold snap and even if I'd managed to keep the plants hydrated, most of them would have been outside and they would have suffered during that minus seven degrees C. Anyways, polonia are one of the varieties that don't struggle in low temperatures. And I do have a few left, not many, those that I do have though, as you can see, coming back strongly now, really enjoying the warmer temperatures and the longer daylight hours. I'm still a huge fan of eucalyptus, great for screening and shelter. Very fast growing and exceptional quality firewood. And if aesthetics are your main priority, then the snow gums are just gorgeous. Fantastic. Having completed my apprenticeship, so to speak, I'm expecting to have excellent results from now on. Good quality plants in large volumes. Thanks a mil to everyone who's stuck with me during the past year. It's much appreciated. Good luck.